Alright, it's Throwback Thursday, where I play a game that I've already reviewed. And this week, I'm going to be doing a request from Matthew Bingham, who's asked me to play Missile Command on the Atari, on the Atari 2600. This was definitely uh, one of my most played... Uh, Atari game, well, no, in the in, in in the neighborhood of you know more often than not played. I don't know if I put it like in my top five uh, most often played games, but it was definitely in the rotation in, in the heavy rotation. Um, let's get her started here. Blast missiles and. It's a pretty good, you know, rendition of the classic. Like many arcade games that the, there was a 2600 version for, this was the first version I ever played. So, I got, you know, it's like whenever I think of Missile Command, you know, I'm usually thinking of this version. Like, it's, it's just kind of by nostalgic purposes, it's the first one that comes to mind. You know, this orange and blue color scheme of the first stage is kind of the vision that I have whenever it's uh, the mental Im image pops up. But, I mean, the thing is, it's like, it's just so smooth, uh, controls-wise, controls-wise. Oh shit, that one's coming down. This is when it starts to, you know, get more interesting. That first stage was, you know, more or less a joke, just giving me the idea of what's going on. And then it gets faster as we go. I remember there was, what was it, M-A-D? I was call, mad, I, I, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, there's the first one down. First city to the ground. This is what would be happening if, uh, oh shit. If we allow Trump full control. I remember this was also one of those games that, uh... My stepfather, who wasn't much of a video game person besides, uh, football games... You know, he played Mario, he played... A lot of, uh... The go-tos, but... This was one of the games, uh, that... He was, uh... I, I distinctly remember him playing, you know, more than a few times. So, you know, you know that you've got a good game on your hands when you can get people who aren't really into playing games, uh, playing them, aka the casual gamer audience. Ah! You know, I don't know why I'm like so... Why well, I'm firing at these laser, at these lasers, at these missiles that I have absolutely no reason to worry about. They're not coming toward the city. Like those. It's like just, I mean, I guess you get points, you get the extra life, but I should not be, I should be targeting the ones that are, that are going to smash. Oh man, I've lost so many. I've lost them all. That's it. I'm gonna get in time. Here it comes! 
cool effect too. Um, you know, a nice little sequence there, like a game over bonus sequence. So twenty three thousand one hundred seventy. I mean, it's whatever. I haven't played this game in forever, so that's my excuse right there. That's my that's what I'm gonna. That's my story. And I'm sticking with it. That's Missile Command. It's a it's a fun game. It's a I mean it's a, it's always a fun game unless you really fuck it up. You know that's usually only any poor is uh, is worth playing. It's just a fun game in general. Just the schematic the uh, the schematics the skeleton of the game itself. It's 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 a good game as long as you don't fuck up the the basics of it. So that's it for this throwback. Uh, feel free to throw a request in, and I'll see you next time.